scepter of the rulers, he who smote the people in wrath with a continual stroke. Never let up, he that ruled the nations in anger is persecuted and unhindered. So when he, when he finally falls, no one is going to uh, stand in the way of his doom. The whole earth is at rest and is quiet. They break forth into singing. They're glad he is through. Yea, the fir trees rejoice at thee, and the cedars of Lebanon saying, since Thou art laid down. No pillar has come up against us. <coughs> All right, I have in there, in my side come, I put Psalm 74, 5. That's the one where you have the uh, man who is had a reputation of uh, taking down big trees. <coughs> Excuse me. Hell from beneath is moved for thee to meet thee at thy coming. It stirreth up the dead for thee, even all the chief ones of the earth. Now I say, uh, we do say that the devil doesn't go to hell, but this would contradict that. Uh, the devil is cast into the lake of fire, but hell is there too. Hell and death was cast in there, in Revelation. Um, uh, Revelation... Now where is that? 2010. Pardon? Is it 2010? Yes, you're right. Now why, why, yeah, there it is. Right there in the last 2010. It stirreth up the dead for thee, even all the chief ones of the earth. It hath raised up from their thrones all the kings of the nations, all they that speak and say unto thee, Art thou also become weak as we? Art thou become like unto us, like a man? Thy pomp is brought down to the grave, and the noise of the, thy vials. So music was created in him, and the noise of thy vials. The worm is spread under thee, and the worms cover thee. You know, where their worm dieth not. All right, so his doom. He's, he, he's slated for eternal destruction. 
his deception. So he has a, a pop about him that uh, he easily tricks the people. And if you, you look about us, and when I think about the, uh, an election, if they say it's a landslide for Trump, 60% vote for Trump and 40% vote for the opposing side, I still say four, then four out of 10 people are still whacked out. They're just whacked out at sea. And you wonder, how can that be? But it is. People are nuts. Uh, if you go to Ephesians chapter 2, who lives in them and works in them? The devil works, the, the, the devil already works in, in them. They're already possessed and being worked at these people. So you gotta have a stronger than that come along to kick him out. I know people don't wanna hear about it, but that's the way it is, it's deception. Um, 2 Corinthians 11, what appears there? Verses 13 through 15. He appears as what? Without turning there. Angel of light. An angel of light. An angel of light. Uh, probably appears in pulpits. Bishop Sheen. Bishop Sheen. There you have it. And only us older ones know what that means. Our verse 11, his depravity. Music is in him. Uh, and it comes uh, through the wrong line. Uh, Genesis 4. Uh, who, inv who invents that? What's his name? Anybody recall? I think it's Tubal Cain. I think. I could be wrong. Let's go there. Music? Yeah, music. Genesis 4, 6. Genesis, Genesis 4, 6. Turn there. There's Cain, verse 21 and 22. And his brother's name was Jubal. And he was the father of all such as Handel, the harp, and organ. And Zilla, uh, she also bare Tubal Cain, an instructor of every, every artifact, the fact, the fastier in brass and iron, the sister of Tubal Cain was Naaman. Basically, it comes to the wrong line. That's why verse 6 is. 16 is in there, and that it is Cain. It comes through, I, oh, I said chapter, verse 6. Verse 16, and Cain went from the presence of the Lord, dwelt in the land of Nod on the east of Eden. So uh, it comes, uh, music comes through, the, the inventor of that comes through the wrong line. And Ezekiel, if we turn to Ezekiel 28, 13, and, and if anybody wants to argue with me about that, you're not arguing with me. You're arguing against God. You, that, that's your problem. You just got to believe what it is. It's demonic. Uh, 2813. Uh, it says there, it, near two-thirds of the way through the verse, the workmanship of thy tablets and of thy pipes was prepared in thee in the day that thou was created. So music is in the devil. It's like it's in people who uh, just just notice a baby when they when they can hear the music going, and they're in their diaper. They're already music is there. There's a there's a, a, a spirit to that. Uh, it could be a good spirit. All right, where do they play music? In the worship service, in the temple. How many people were employed in that, by the way? I believe it's 20,000 people. They did it in ships. They did it in ships. And they were a specific tribe, a specific, a specific group of that tribe was trained in that. They're trained in that. Uh, his domain, verse 12, Isaiah 14, verse 12. How art thou fallen from heaven, O Lucifer, son of the morning? How art thou cast down to the ground, which just weakened the nations? 
He's fallen from heaven. When is he cast out, by the way? In what chapter in the Bible? In what book? Anybody know? Revelation 12. There was war in heaven, and Michael fought with the devil and his angels, and he was cast out. But we believe right now he still has access to the throne room, as it says in Job. And he, had, and he swims, Lucifer swims between third heaven and the first heaven here. And what we call the second heaven is what you look at out at the stars. He swims in there, in that sea. And he's going to be waiting for us at the rapture. At the rapture. But the Lord will get us through. Uh, his domain, uh, he is the prince and power of the air, Ephesians 2. two. Uh, in fact, why don't we just go there and read it just to refresh our memories. Two, two, uh, where in time past he walked according to the course of this world, according to the prince and the power of the air, the spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience. He works in them. All right? You, you may have neighbors like that, people that you know, that you're, they're full of the devil. They're full of the devil. Prince of power of the air. Satan has a seat. Revelation 2, 13. I think it's Revelation 16. His kingdom is a kingdom of what? Anybody know? Darkness. Darkness. Revelation 2.13 I know thy works and where thou dwellest even where Satan's seat is and thou holdest fast my name and hast not denied my faith, my faith even in those days wherein Antipas was my faithful martyr who was slain among you where Satan dwelleth. So he has a seat. Uh, he has access to the throne room. Now, we already discussed that. Uh, where, where have you been? So he said, well, going to and fro throughout the earth. And he, and he makes a report. And he, uh, and he uh, witnesses against Job and against uh, God's favoritism towards him. Uh, we've already mentioned in Revelation 12, he is cast out of heaven. Cast out. We've already, we've already talked about that. He, he, Michael and his archangels fought with the devil and his angels. In fact, it gives a, a, a let's go to Revelation 12. Seven through 13, he's called the dragon in 13. The dragon saw that he was cast under the earth. He's called the dragon, he's called in verse nine, the old serpent called the devil and Satan. He deceiveth the whole world. <coughs> the whole world is deceived. Uh, but who is not supposed to be deceived? I, I wanna it would be the elect. Uh, they're not they're not tricked. Uh, go to Revelation 16. I believe it's Revelation 16. It's verse 13. Um, all right, verse 10. Go to Revelation 16, verse 10. The fifth angel poured out his vial upon the seat of the beast. His kingdom was full of darkness, and they gnawed their tongues for pain. It's a dark place. It is, uh, and the sixth seal poured out his vial upon the great river Euphrates. By the way, where does the river Euphrates show up in the beginning of the Bible? Creation. In the creation. And it's where, where, what is located there? There's three rivers. Isn't it the Garden of Eden? Yeah. Two of the rivers are gone. The Euphrates is the only one that still yet remains. Unless the rivers, the, the names were changed. The great river Euphrates and the water there was dried up. I got people right now telling me that the Euphrates is right now dried up. Yeah. Is that a true statement? That's what we hear. That's what we hear. But if you do a, a zoom on your phone, is there water in there? I don't know. 
But that's what people are saying. I've heard Lots that. of people have seen that. And the water there was dried up. Now, why is it dried up? To let out the, 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 the prison spirit. All right, that's one theory. What's the other one? To make a way for the uh, Army of the East. The Army of the East, made up of how many? Oh, 200 million. 200 million. And what army has enough to have 200 million people in it? The Devil's Army. The Devil's Army, which would be what country? China. China. That's one theory. Three unclean spirits. I really question anybody that has frogs. <laughs> it's like frogs. I know people, one in particular, they collect frogs. All kinds of frogs, any frog they can get, and they fill their house up with frogs. It just, just kind of a scary thing. Come out of the mouth of the dragon, and out of the mouth of the beast, and out of the mouth of the false prophet. They're likened unto frogs. And it is, there's the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. This is the un, there's the Holy Trinity, and this is the unholy Trinity, which is the dragon, the beast, and the false prophet. The dragon, the beast, and the false prophet. One is seen, one is not seen, and the other one uh, is, is uh, uh, the force that, that kind of directs it all. So of the, of the Holy Trinity, God is not seen. Which is the one that is seen? Christ. Jesus Christ is seen. And the one that has this force and empowers the Holy Spirit. And that would be the same that would be true of these three. So you, you don't see the devil, you see the image of that through one of those. And then one is the one that uh, kind of directs everything of the three, the dragon, the beast, and the false prophet, the unholy trinity. Uh, he has a seat, access to the throne room, and he's cast out of heaven. Now, these are some of his designations, uh, number E here. He is called Lucifer, only place in the Bible. I believe it's in only one Bible, and that's the King James Bible, only one Bible. He's called the devil 36 times in the Bible. He's called Satan 53 times. He's called that wicked one six times. He is called wicked one time, and you can read these for yourself. He's the prince of this world. John 14, 30. Always remember, who is in, who's in control right now on this earth? It is the prince of this world. He's the god of this world. It's a lowercase g. He's the god of this world. He is the serpent nine times. Roaring lion once. Old serpent two times. Leviathan four times. Thou feedest them with the heads of Leviathan. The theory of that is that a uh, manna will come back and the manna that God's going to use to feed the children of Israel is the heads of Leviathan. It's, it's going to be a perpetual barbecue. Feeding is Israel in the wilderness with the literal body of the devil. He is called the tempter two times. Adversary one time. Father of lies, John. Father of lies, John. Eight. You have your father, the devil. Oh, go to Johnny. I think it's Johnny. He says that to the Pharisees. John 8. John chapter 8. You have your father the devil, and the lust of your father ye you will do. He was a murderer from the beginning, and both not in the truth, because there is no truth in him. 
When, when he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own, for he is the liar and the father of it. The father of lies. He is the son of the morning, as it says there in uh, Isaiah 14. He is Beelzebub. He is the uh, son of Belial. There are those that walk the face of the earth. They belong to him. And they're walking in our midst all the time. The sons of Bel Belial. What is the name of the devil in there? With Belial. Belial. Well, if you just take Belial, how do you know it's the devil? What if you... Belial, that's three syllables. Oh. <coughs> Bel. Belshazzar, right? Wasn't he one of the uh, kings in Daniel? Belshazzar. Whenever you see that, you know you got you got Satan. So you don't want to name your kid with a B E L in it. He is the anointed cherub that covereth. In Ezekiel twenty-eight five. How many cherubs are there? Four. The anointed one. If there's another one. He is the fifth chair. What is the, uh, number five? The number of and, uh, death. Uh, uh, traditional Methodist and the rest of the Protestantism, five is the number of what? Man. Grace. Because um, Jesus had five deadly wounds, etc., etc. What's the number of man? Number of man is six. The sixth day he was created, the number of man. That's, our, that's the number of man. The number of the Antichrist, 666. It's the number of man. The anointed cherub that covered. How does he cover? What is he covering? Mercy seat. He would be covering the mercy seat. And his wings are spread out. And he covers that. There's pictures of stuff that depict that. He is the fifth chair, but he has the, the face of an ox because the, all four of them are named off. It's named chair of the one. The, the word that is not used in place of ox is chair, so he has the face of an ox. We looked that up last week. Uh, in fact, why don't we go to Ezekiel just to see it. Ezekiel 28, verse 14. The easiest way to remember the two major places where the devil is is 14, Isaiah 14, just multiply 14 times 2, Ezekiel 28. Thou art the anointed cherub that covereth, and I have set thee so that thou wast upon the holy mountain of God, thou walked up and down in the midst of stones of fire. What is the only stone not found there? Diamond. The diamond. The atomic number 666. What's the verse? The uh, 14. 2814. Ezekiel. Ezekiel, yes. He is the dragon 11 times. So when the, when the kiddies, I, I, I'm not, I, I'm not favored. I, I, I don't really like it when they are walking around with dragons. They, they love it though. And so what were they training the kids 30 years ago? Which dragon? In the cartoons. Pete? No. Huh? No. Well, that's one. Barney. Barney. And he was what color? Purple. 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 Yeah, Barney the purple dragon. No, before Barney there was Pete Pete's dragon. Oh, there was another one. And then and then they sing about it. Puff the magic dragon. Well, that's not drugs or whatever. Yeah. Well, there you have it. There you have it, drugs. And so where does, um, what is the word? Where they get the uh, drugs from and the pharmaceutical, word pharmacy and drugs from, it's in Revelation. Can't think of the uh, word. No, that's not it. That'd be a good guess, but that's not it. It's, it's where, the word pharmacy is derived, and it's drugs. Folks, the, we're, we're here. We have arrived. It's where they get drugs from, the word from pharmacy. And people are all, and, and now, it, in fact, 
marijuana really is helpful and it doesn't do any harm and the moon is made out of cheese. Well, no, it's, it's, not, mar it's not just marijuana, it's prescription drugs. Oh, it is. It's, uh, oh, it's psychological, right. antidepressants, antipsychotics. It's, it's amazing how many people are taking them. It's every. Maybe it's helpful to some people, but they're way over yeah, there's, there, there's something really, really wrong. Really wrong. If we get down to the nitty gritty and the, the actual physical, earthly aspects of it that are everyday life, we're going to be talking about the deep state today. I will mention Donald Trump, and you don't like these. We have people that don't like that. They will threaten me. They will say, we don't have them here now. You mentioned that one more time, we're leaving. Well, I'm, I'm sorry it's in the Bible, too bad. So sorry. If you mention it, well then bye bye. Out of here. Dragon 11 times. The great red dragon one time. Great dragon one time. He is the usurper. He is, and we've already discussed that, the angel. In fact, let's go there. The angel of light. Verse 3 of, of 2 Corinthians is, is uh, uh, the simplicity that is in Christ. Oh, I mean, people just stomp their feet. It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. We're, we're not doing the Boy Scouts or the Girl Scouts, and we're not doing a, a jazz exercise in here. That we're not doing. Okay, verse 3. Uh, the simplicity that is in Christ. Now, if you skip over here, uh, uh, verse 13. For such are false apostles. Now, if, if the devil wants to be busy, the, be the best place he, could, he figures he could be busy is in the church. He wants to defile that. And that will come up in the sermon. Deceitful workers transforming themselves into the apostles of Christ. And, uh, and what does John say? And they have found them to be what? Liars. All right? Because there are no more apostles in apostolic succession. Apostles of Christ. And no marvel, for Satan himself is transformed into an angel of light. Therefore, it is no great thing if his ministers also be transformed as the ministers of righteousness, whose end shall be according to their works. All right. Turning the page. Uh, now we have uh, we have lists of his name. That list is not exhaust exhausted. He is called the Assyrian. He is um, uh, so we're looking for a half breed. He is uh, a mixture of the leopard, uh, something else. I can't think of it right now. But we have it up there where we have, uh, I hope, an exhaustive list of everything that describes the devil. His doings. 2 Corinthians 4.4. 4. We should already know this. He, is, he blinds their minds. It's a mental thing. You think people are whacked out? It's, uh, they're whacked out mentally. He blinds their minds. Wiles, the, the wiles of the devil, when we put on the full armor of God to protect ourselves from, wiles means to trick, uh, he's very sly, to lure men. The wiles of the devil. And uh, he uh, and he wants to get to, uh, Israel. He hates the woman. He hates the woman. If we go to Revelation 12, Revelation 12. Okay, we begin in verse uh, 1. And there appeared a great wonder in heaven, a woman, clothed with the sun. And now some people want to say that's the church. Why isn't that the church? With just that uh, four or five words I said. The sun. 
No. First four four words. Uh, first one. First one of chapter twelve. The very first. Why is that not the church? Church. <coughs> Pardon. Church is a virgin. The church is a virgin. She would be called a maid. Uh, not a woman. She is the church is not married yet. Now, if you if you look at it, let's say the Lord says she is already married. Well, the Lord already deals in the future, past, present. He deals in, in, in all that. What is the woman then? Israel. It's Israel because Israel is already married to God. Already married. So this is Israel. Pardon? This is Israel. This is Israel. In other words, the devil here is busy. He hates. He hates the Jew. We're in a great wonder in heaven. A woman. Oh, I'm. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's not the first four words. A woman clothed with the sun and the moon under her feet, and upon her head a crown of twelve stars. Then what would be the twelve stars? The twelve tribes. The, the twelve tribes. Then, if it's the church. Those that interpret that, what are those 12? Apostles. 12 apostles, right there, another one. 12 what, the, What's that up there in the throne room with their crowns? There's 24 of them. Elders. They, to, yeah, 24 elders. So they'll, they'll say they're the 12 apostles and the 12 tribes, so they're throwing their crowns at the Lord's feet. But that's where they're going to go. They'll go to the apostles. Uh, you know, it, it, it's nice. It, it sort of fits. But they're dead wrong. They're dead wrong. And she being with child, obviously, this is Jesus, travail, travailing in birth and pain to be delivered. And there appeared another wonder in heaven. Behold, a great red dragon, having seven heads and ten horns, and seven crowns upon his head. His tail drew the third part of the stars of heaven. You want a full description of them? It is found in Job chapter what? Full description. 42. No, 41. And did cast them to the earth. And dragon stood before the woman which was ready to be delivered, for to devour her child as soon as it was born. I mean, uh, the devil's been after the Lord right from the beginning to trick Eve. He wanted to destroy the line. He wants to destroy. He knows his doom is coming. And his doom came at the cross and he still hates. She brought forth a man child who was to rule uh, all the nations with rod of iron and her child was caught up unto the God and to his name. All right, well that shows what the, uh, the man child's coming back as. He's not coming back as the meek and lowly shepherd. He's coming back as the uh, the King of Kings, King of Kings, and the Lord of Lords. Revelation. Just give me the chapter. <clears throat> no. Did you say twenty-three? There's only twenty-two. Eighteen. Eighteen or nineteen. It's eighteen or nineteen. Lord of Lords and King of Kings. And he's going to rule them with a rod of iron. Uh, folks, we're going to rule with him. I mean, we're, we're not playing patty cake and having a nice sit-down discussion so we can all get along. This is off topic, but if you read verse 6, yes, uh, I'm going to probably keep my mouth shut here. Go! But could that be the time that until Jesus comes back, it says 2,203 score days, maybe that's the number that he waits to come back. Well, they try to work these numbers out in, in like three and a half years, and, and so on from his from his death on the cross. Oh, uh, how many days? Two thousand two hundred three score. Yeah. So if we do that, two hundred three. Uh, if we do that, then we're, we're really at Jewish time. <laughs> we got a long way. Yeah, a long way. We 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 got a long way. Yeah. Long is that a very true religion? Yeah, I would think that's what we say. It's a three and a half years, and there's some other uh, time in there, a month or two, that doesn't line up. They, they don't have it all down. But there's some, you know, good, educated guesses. Somebody's right. But listen, if, uh, if you got four, four guesses, only one can be right, or all could be wrong. But not all can be right. 
prepared uh, or he has fled in the wilderness oh, and where does she flee in the wilderness one of the theories is she runs where um, I mean if we go to if we go to Rockman what his theory is Petra. Petra. I don't know what that's based on I, I know I know but there's a city there yeah. where is that at Oh, it's out there. If you go to Silo Petra and click, click, it's a city out there, and uh, it's deserted. It's in the desert. It's in Jordan. It's in Jordan. Well, it's, close to the desert. It's not too far from the Dead Sea. And it's got uh, pillars and all. It looks like a city. It's a tourist attraction. I think there's a narrow way in there, a very narrow way in, and then she leaves. She leaves, uh, one, one of them is by the eagle. And then who, I mean, we're, we're jumping to a lot of conclusions. What is our national thing? An eagle. An, an eagle. I, I have another thing, um, go ahead, sir. And so America gets her out via TWA. I mean, he actually shows a plane, TWA, flying around. Yes. It's too bad they're out of business. Huh? It's too bad they're out of business. I think America's going to be out of business too. Say that again? I said I think America might be out of business by then too. And America may be out of business. Yeah, I've had thought that. Because they they claim America doesn't show up in the Bible. It's supposed to be bad before the rapture, right? So when he destroyed Sodom and Gomorrah, it was bad. Can you honestly say that America's like Sodom and Gomorrah? There was only, there was only 10 righteous in the whole city. If you did it on percentages, Americans don't work close to being that bad. No, I run to the verse. There's it, uh, Eli Elijah said it, it's bad. I'm the last man standing. And, and God said there's seven thousand. There's seven thousand and others. Seven. The number of complete. There'll always be. The, and we call that a remnant. There's always a remnant. But if you look, who's up for who's who's a lot? Uh, there's a primary coming up this week. Cheney? Cheney. And what is she? I don't know. Rhino. A rhino. What else is she? A lesbo. A lesbo. <laughs> she is? She is. Oh, yeah. Oh, she's, no, she's not. No. Her sister is. Her sister is. Her sister is? Yeah. Her younger yeah. sister. She's got kids. And... Hey, rhino, lesbo, I, I don't know. I'm going to assume that she's not, though. She doesn't look I was told that she was. No. no? Well, she's married and got kids. Obviously not. Well, that's oh, no. oh, I know people who are married, sister, had kids, and they the go. It's the younger sister. I, think. I always said that about the, the, you know, God showing his mercy with Sodom and Gomorrah, and then there's only time left and he had enough. Well, I don't think America's close to that. I think America's very close to that. Well, I hope, we, I hope, because I don't I want to. Yeah. Listen, when we were in the Mennonite Church. I don't want to be buying now. When we were in the Mennonite Church. There's a split here and a split there, and the and the the wifey is a lesbian. It's a mess. Well, the other night when I wherever was you go, man, the church inviting inviting the LGBTQ. They were. They're, yeah, it says it on the big sign. We love LGBTQ. All right, we went to the uh, we went to Northfield Presbyterian. Uh, 40 years ago. Didn't we? And so Starla wanted to go to a uh, vacation Bible school. I said, well, why don't I, why don't I just drop you off there? Well, I walked in there. I had the shock of my life. Man. It wasn't what I was expecting. It was one big mess. No, you and I went there 40 years ago. Oh. You and I. <coughs> And it was the traditional, yeah. you wouldn't be terrified to run out of there. We weren't saved, but you wouldn't be terrified where it's so obvious. I mean, this was obvious. Like, what has happened? We used to have a guy come back here. He, he knew Patty's daughter's boyfriend. It was Patty's da daughter's boyfriend. He would come back here periodically. For one reason only. Do you remember? He was a big guy. I don't think he was. A, I don't know what he was. He was in construction stuff. Why, why did he keep coming back here? 
He wanted to see if we changed. You know? He wanted to see if we changed. And every time he came back, he said, I'm glad you haven't changed. He says, because we don't go, we don't go anywhere. He says, it's changing everywhere. Now, is that a true statement or is that an overstatement? No, it's true. Yeah, but it's changing everywhere. Now, I don't believe it's changing everywhere, but it's, it's <laughs> pretty prevalent. Pretty prevalent. It is changing. And we don't want to be part of that group. And yeah, we haven't seen him now in 10 years, 15 years. It's been a long time. The bill, this was up when he came back. But he wanted to make sure we were not changing. I think he lived in Hudson. I should take a picture of him and show you. <coughs> his doings, uh, he wants Israel. Uh, he persecuted the woman, verse 13, which brought forth the man child. He persecutes this woman. It's kind of like uh, Trump, the deep state. They're persecuting him. They can't seem to get enough of it. His desire, uh, Matthew 4, Luke 4. Uh, what is Matthew 4 and Luke 4? What's his desire? Well, his ministry? The, that's a temptation. Yeah, the temptation. He comes out in the wilderness. Holy Spirit leads him out there, and he wants to, he wants to get him. Uh, uh, by the way, I, I read some places he said all of that stuff will come true. Uh, turn these stones into bread. Jump off the uh, the temple, and I'll give you all these kingdoms. Why and how are all these things true? We've been over this. The, the reaper will be behind the sword during the millennium. At the moment you plant within within days, you're, you're, you're lopping it off and harvesting. That's how plentiful it will be. They'll, every eye will see him. In other words, they'll see it jump off the top. No, every eye's gonna look up and Jesus will come back and everybody will see him. And he is going to be the king, king of Lord Lords. He's gonna have all the, he said, well, you know what? That's a good thought, devil, but uh, I'll wait. Right? He has to just wait a couple days, two, 2,000 years, two days in his time. And all this stuff that you say I'm going to have is all going to come true. It's all going to come true. It's just, it's just for stall for a couple days for the Lord. He, he couldn't give in to the devil because if he did, he would, be in, he would have been blessed by the devil. He would have been a beneficiary of like you, the grace you, of the devil. Like everything he tempted him with, the Lord already knows, well, I'm, I'm going to have all that. So if you already know you're going to have it, why well, be tempted to take it? Just wait your two days. Okay, uh, let's go to these other two verses. Desire Luke 22. Luke 22, 31. And the Lord said, Simon, Simon, behold, Satan hath desired to have you, that he may sift you as wheat. He desires to have us. Ephesians 4, 27. Neither give place to the devil. Now you got anger. Uh, in this case, um, we apply this to a husband and wife before they uh, uh, sin not, let not the sun go down upon your head. I mean, when you go to bed, all you're going to do is stew about it. So you, you don't want to have all that anger. It, it's just, it's uh, anger. Put off these things. What are we to put off? Anger, wrath, malice, envy. All that stuff's got to be put off. And it's my place to keep telling you. And if you can't get it, I'm still going to tell you until, until I'm dead. Whether I'm preaching or not, I call it a wedge. It's it's a wedge driver. All right, his demise, Jude nine. Uh, he, uh, it is in chains, waiting for judgment. Michael the archangel, when contending with the devil, he disputed about the body of There's not bring against him a railing accusation, but said, "Don't work with you." Uh, why is it that um, uh, 
you don't want to have or find the body of Moses. We've been over this. We cannot find the body of Moses. Oh, the body of worship is? They'll worship it. And who buried Moses? Jesus. Jesus did. It said the Lord buried him. He got a shovel. Jesus came and he dug a hole and buried Moses. And nobody knows where the place is. It's kind of like the ark. We're not going to find the ark. It's because of all in worship. They claim the ark had found it. I know. And I've seen those programs. Uh, uh, otherwise, where is your. Say it out loud. Faith. Where's your faith? Without faith, it is what? Impossible. Impossible to please God. James 4, 7. And by the way, this homosexual thing, it is infiltrated everywhere. 4, 7. Submit yourselves, therefore, to God. Resist the devil, and he will flee from you. All right? We're to resist him. He... he, he uh, Oh, by the way, he can't have that wicked one, as it says there in 1 John chapter 5, that wicked one touches us, us not. Uh, 1 Peter 5, as a roaring lion, I believe. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the, de the, the lion, uh, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. Now, I've had some preachers say this. Well, that, uh, well, we have to quit there. That the devil, this as a roaring lion, what, what part of the lion is missing? I don't, and I don't believe it for a minute. What does it, the, the devil as a roaring lion, what does he not have? Teeth. Teeth. That's what they'll say. Well, it's a lion that doesn't have teeth. Oh, please. Please. So that's a nice, nice cute way of saying keep on sinning, man. <laughs> Just well, he is seeking whom he may devour. So yeah, that's what it says. Uh, but they get he's toothless out of that. But that's what they that's what they come up with. I, I don't know where these guys come up with that stuff, but they do. They come up with all kinds of things. People, I guess people could say that about me, man. I. Uh, I don't know. I think he's giving a lot of people a hard time. So what's he got? Yeah, what's he got? But he's got teeth. He's got teeth. All right, we will pick this up. His destruction. We uh, uh, will pick this up here next week. All right, preaching in just a few moments.